one will ask what if adinasa refuse to come what if he decide not to come when the 14 days is over what is the next step um i'm going to answer your question with a parable or with a, parable, <laughs> a proverb and you will do the best to help us with the creation <laughs> yes nobody me a catch a vana a sorry allah son top of a dumb me a catch a vana a soa allah son top a dumb no no go go it's a town a beautiful town a peaceful town mm. then the supreme deity not only for Nogoko, but the entire of the Nyigba. Because see, when we are doing Thanksgiving, I think... I hope from Mwakwaba, Eddie Ba, Vimbas TV. So when you unsubscribe here, my YouTube channel, a Dino A Vimbas, a YouTube. Yeah, Kai will say, me a subscribe button on now, a 10 notification. And so on Nogoko 4, I send a very strong warning to Archbishop Charles Ajenasari BM. Now, I'm a spokesperson, Kobla Nonibe, and I send this warning. I'm a chairman, they still stand by the 14 days ultimate to Momodia Mano. So, I'm a PM, I'm a Mushirina, they will advise themselves. Now, Kasa, I'm running on the fire, the nation blogger, Etrich, in Commons. Also, to us, which I'm a Nogopo is a town, and Crawford Womb, the deity, and now the thunder strike King Gosa, I'm a one so I the town, in Munti. Archbishop Charles Ajenasari talking about the town also touches uh their gods and uh, untina just say uh, the gods who advise themselves should he fail to come also, also explain is say uh, one of the main reason why they are inviting archbishop charles ajinasari to nogopo is that he should help them fight the demonic uh principalities any power say what on my town ni mu send a bear their town will be free of any demonic attack just as he said say nogopo is a demonic headquarters of the voter region when got here the spokesperson of nogopo kobla no nyigbe e kan ye emrana oni of fire o etwen come oni ni adwen a for adwen chere e fa comment section no e ma ye vimba so e na nogopo is a town a beautiful town a peaceful town then the supreme deity, not only for Nogoko, but the entire of the Nyigba. Because see, when we are doing Thanksgiving, I think probably I, have to, I will be inviting you to when we want to do the annual Thanksgiving. I will be coming. And see the number of people that come from all over the world, not mm. only here, all over the world and in Africa, who come. It's the only supreme energy when it's moving or when we are doing its Thanksgiving, it moves to click up. Afifa, Af Adafia, it, it moves. I don't know if the comment from Adinasare was um, about the deity or the shrine or about the community. We want to get the understanding clearly how the Nogoko leaders and the elders, how you've taken the comment. Is it about the town? Is it an attack on the town or on the shrine or the deity? Well, uh, thank you very much. Thank you very much. It is our, for your question. Mm. Um, first of all, it is an attack on the community. Mm. Mm -hmm. One thing we need to understand is one an attack on the community. Now, mm. the community stand alone, and mm -hmm. the thunder god also stands alone. Now, mm -hmm. as I said initially, most people think when you mention Nogoko you are referring to the thunder god but mm. they don't know that nogoko on its own is a community it's a town on its own uh -huh. mm. so his attack was on the community but community is made up of the people and everything that is on the land so what we did with the press conference mm. it was the dufia was 
Mr. Dufia and his elders that are inviting him mm. to come and answer some few questions because mm. in our wisdom, in our knowledge, we know that Nogopo is not a demonic, it's not demonic, mm. and therefore cannot be the headquarters of demons in the water region. Mm. So we needed to come and explain certain things because we don't want to live with demons mm. in the community. Now I told you mm. the community we have sixteen co sixteen community that made up of Nogoko. So okay, we want him to come and help us locate that particular area. You understand where mm. the demons are, so that he being the man of God or oh, man, sorry, man of God, will mm. help us do the cleansing of the town. Mm. That is on the, that side. That is why we invited him. Uh, and one thing people don't understand is that we, the Evers, for a very long time, we have been demonized wrongly on so many grounds. Mm. And we, we are trying as much as our best, or we are trying to correct the narratives that people perceived about us. You mm. understand? Then all of a sudden, someone like Arjuna Sari should come and make such a statement. It's not only about Nogoku. He said, the demonic headquarters of the Volta region. You have Meaning the whole Volta region is full of demons. Mm. Mm. He has demonized the entire region or of the Nyiba in general and then mm. narrowed it to Nogoko as the headquarters. And that is where we see it as a big problem. So it, literally, he was trying to say that we, the, the Votarians, are demons. Mm -hmm. And our headquarters is in Nogoku. For me, for someone like Ajina Sari to make such a, a statement or such a, a reckless statement, mm -hmm. we realize that it is not only about what he said about Nogoku. But the presume uh, the presumption of who we are, and we want him to do that correct to do what is needful for mm. us. Nogoku is a demonic town. Everybody, mm. even if you go, to, if you come to Nogoku, the assemblyman in Nogoku is a member of Ajinasari's church. He he teaches at the Sunday school site. When he oh. saw the video, he was like, "Ow." Oh. Why would Bishop say that about my town? You understand? Mm. Because he is a Christian, but he's the assemblyman. If his service is needed at the temple, he goes there. I remember recently we had a delegation from Miro. He's the one who, who took them into the temple. But he's a member of his church. Because everyone knows that the temple is a sacred place. It's a holy place. So no evil is entertained in there. So if you're a Christian and you have a genuine heart, you can pay a visit. We don't have any problem with that. We have a lot of people coming from all different places. So for him to make such a statement, and my brother, listen, if you listen to his video carefully, mm. he said they went to do a crusade in Aplau and hmm? he destroyed all the demons and witches and wizards in Aplau, there, maybe mm -hmm. not in there. So, mm -hmm. and on their way back, they had problem with their ties. Thus, him blaming a whole community mm. as a demonic headquarters. So the question again is, which demons did he destroy in Aplau? Mm. <laughs> yeah. Mm. 
which demons did he destroy in our power so it means that Ajina Sari is lying about destroying the demons in our flower because oh. you claim the demons removed the ties out of your car the demons he claimed he have destroyed in our flower mm. so which means those demons are powerful than him is there nobody <laughs> <laughs> we are not taking time to interrogate what he said you understand because a lot of people are part of the system excuse me to say are now christians so they think because they are christians and what he said should be taken lightly and talking about him going into the spiritual realm and all that my brother when it comes to spirituality, we are more powerful and more discerning in that area than any Christian pastor. See, I don't want it to sound, but if they want to show off that they are powerful, they should come one on one on challenge. Like the way they say they are bar in the Bible, Elijah, and not, they should come one on one. And let's see who will go home limping. Mm. We are serious about this. Mm. You understand. But Ghana is, is a very peaceful place. You understand. Mm. Ghana, we all want Ghana to be a very peaceful place. So mm. you have Christian religion, Islamic religion. Though our tradition, our spirituality, there's no founder. So you cannot label it as a religion. Mm -hmm our tradition our spirituality you cannot label it as what a religion a religion is when some a religion has a founder islamic religion has a founder christian religion has a founder but when you come to there's no founder it came with the universe it came with our fathers that's a goma a joke so that is why today if you ask me who is the founder of traditional religion there's no there but by because of the european have written it as a traditional african traditional religion we have accepted it as a spokesperson i want you to let the people know clearly why are the traditional leaders calling Ajinasari to come to Nugopo? well um thank you once again uh, mm. it's as simple as abc if mm. you offend someone people are saying that he apologized he has apologized mm. he has apologized he's apologized but we don't see that as an apology the truth is in african tradition if you offend mm. your brother if you offend someone you go to the person to go and apologize you don't sit comfortably in your bedroom and then throw it to the air that my wife is from the voter region that 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 i cannot do anything no in african tradition when no, you offend you someone uh, can you hear me? Let me. Let, I, I, I like something you just said. In African tradition, when you offend somebody, repeat that 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 side again. All that I'm saying that within the mm. African tradition, yes, within mm. the African tradition, mm. when one offends someone, you go to the mm. person. By mm. what we've been taught, mm. you wake up and go to the person mm. and go and beg and apologize to the mm. person you don't use the mm. same medium to send your apology it's a sign mm. of disrespect to the one mm. you've offended that is it mm. so that is why we are asking him to come and do the needful you understand and secondly uh, uh our brothers or the our cousins the accounts will say 
we go a crono fee. You understand? We go a crono fee. A daddy a duanchi. Canava Namiako, a lekimia, we acro acro a dial a duanchi. That is all we are saying. And we cannot just come to say, oh, he should just come we need to give him a time frame we mm. need to give him a time frame to appear before the elders mm. and the important is still stunts ultimatum still stunts so that mm. he will come so that apologize mm. and then we do the needful miyako aduanchi Miaklonchi na dianchi na ko. Eh, that is all we are saying. We don't want anything extraordinary for from Ajina Sari. We are not angry people. We are peaceful, mm. law-abiding citizens who go on with our normal day-to-day -day activity, just like any other Ghanaian. You understand? Mm. So that is all why we are asking him to come. With Yes, we said he should come and meet the elders, the chief, as a palace. Mm. For a amicable solution to this. That is all we are saying. Mm. One will ask, what if Adinasai refuse to come? What if he decide not to come? When the 14 days is over, what is the next step? Um, I'm going to answer your question with a parable or with a, parable, <laughs> a proverb and you will do the best to help us with the creation. <laughs> yes. Obadi, me a kachu avana a swari. Allah son topa doma. Me a kachu avana a swa. Allah son topa doma. Na lo. Mm. Um, uh, your network is uh, kind of like I don't know if the people are getting you clearly. Um, can you repeat it again? Oh. I don't know if the, the, somebody is calling your line. If if, if what call comes through, that. you know, distract it. No, I am. Um, I think it's the network uh, okay. because I have. I'm using a Wi-Fi and i've blocked any oh, okay. incoming call so it's an on, on, on aeroplane mode so no call can oh, okay. probably whatsapp call can come through yeah oh, okay. maybe call like that but direct call may not but can you hear me now oh now you are clear you are clear mm. Mm. my name it's okay um we can hear you now i don't know if you can hear me Yes, I can um, hear you. What I'm saying, I'm going to yeah, answer your you question now. with a proverb. Yes, I'm going to answer your question with a proverb. And I would like you to help us do the, the translation in Chi. Uh -huh. <laughs> if we... <laughs> yes. Obadi. Mi aka chupa avana a swari. Ala swan topa doma. And the man from Yagro. Hey, so if you can do the translation mm. for us mm. how do i even translate this uh also the person was changing and say uh the hr uh assume a simple man or assume a cm and i don't know if i've got it right adiana adiana hr uh opongo 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 a opongo Okay. 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 Okay.
spokesperson of Nogoku Kobla Nonyigbe and Akasa Achese was so I send a strong warning to Archbishop Charles Ajina Sari. Now, for the meantime, uh, fans and supporters of Archbishop say, unforget him. Now, after the 14 days, no, they should show uh, the power that they have. Anyhow, it goes, no, any update on this, yeah, they better bring Vimbas. So, and now we can subscribe, and turn on notification on your yeah, CP. Vimbas TV.